This is the optical setup that I use for doing the Schlieren photography. Um, it's basically a camera mount. It's all homemade. I have a, a linear slide at the bottom here that there's three bearings that sit on that can slide back and forth, all three of these in a line. Uh, behind it over here is a pinpoint light source that I made out of a diode. I'll get to that in a minute. On the back here there's this piece of aluminum channel that I drill the hole in and I can set a camera on there and screw it in from the bottom to hold the camera. This isn't the camera that I use for the photography. The camera I use is actually the one I'm filming with right now. But the camera would sit here. I can position the camera back and forth in front of the camera there's this filter on a little window and this is on a slide as well you can slide back and forth so I can use that as the Schlieren stop I guess is what it's called uh, so that as the light uh, refracts because of the temperature or density gradients uh, some of it goes through the green side some doesn't that adds the color then in front of that is a half of a binocular uh, that I use as a telephoto lens. So this half of binocular is mounted to an XY uh, stage. I can drive it up and down with these verniers. So I can position the binocular or zoom lens if you want to call it that directly in front of the camera. Once I get everything where I want it I can slide it all back and forth to set the focus all three pieces independently. It's mounted to a piece of plywood and I focus it downrange on the parabolic mirror uh, that I mentioned last week that's on a, uh, a kinematic mount that I made. And there's a video about how I made that as well. The light source that I use is a LED that I ground the, the bullet lens end of it off, wrapped it in aluminum tape, uh, and then poked a hole in the middle. So it's just a pinpoint of light. I got that idea from a, another site about Schlieren photography. It's on the web that I'll link to from my blog. Uh, the LED is powered by a homemade power supply that I built about a year ago. Uh, there's actually details of how I did that on my blog as well. And then the wires for the LED are run through a brass tube uh, and then held by one of these magnetic bases. It's adjustable in every direction. So I can use that to position the light right at the focal point of the mirror. Uh, for details or instructions on how to set all of this up for uh, Schlieren photography, you can go to my blog. I have several posts there showing how I set it up using both mirrors uh, and lenses and examples of pictures and videos that my son and I made.